rock steady at King of the Pit TV. There's rock steady King of the Pit TV. Shout out to my man Joel N for the recommendation. Put me onto a bit of boundaries. Never listened to this man before this. May have seen him pop up from time to time, but never, you know what I mean, was in the space to check him out, whether that be in a live environment or on record, all right? This isn't necessarily something I go out of my way to listen to, like this new age, uh, low chug stuff. I did back in the day. Back in the day, I enjoyed a little bit of music like this, but I'm quite detached from it now, you see. So it's nice to be able to delve in and listen to what's going on. This is definitely a tight band, talented band, great guitar work. I want to hear the pit beef riff. I want to hear a pit beef riff of all pit beef riffs. I know they can put one together. I'm hoping it's in this number. As always, we're halfway through the record, so let me just say if you want to recommend music such as My Man Joel, click the link down in the description. You'll have access to all of my uh, full album listen-throughs from the moment I upload them. Let's go. Resent and regret. Come on. We're getting emotional. So conceptually, we've got resent and regret, and then the next track is called Realize and Rebuild. Come on. A lot of death on this record, lyrically. A lot of talking about death and dying. Come on. These tears don't fall. I heard the words there, it's a deep one, it's a deep one. Can they add the pit riff into this number? Because this is a, an emotionally driven real talk tune they've put together for this one. It's, uh, <laughs> them clean vocals at the starting guitars are a lot of like the music I used to really enjoy back in the day. I used to play RuneScape and like put on these uh, post hardcore slash, uh, you know, soft metal core acts that had a lot of sections like that. I'm not being perfect. 
I wonder how much was paid for the recording process. Because it's good, good quality recording. A lot of stuff going on. So let's see if we follow the same soundscape with this next one, realize and rebuild, or we just completely turn it on, turn it on its head. So that was resent and regret. That was a nice change of pace, a nice change of energy with that one. It's a real showcase of what the band is capable of. As someone who's only just listened to this band from this point, it's uh, it shows a lot of uh, maturity and depth. Realize and rebuild coming up next. All right.